Hi, this is Amy. Welcome to Wheel Throwing Part 1. This video shows you how to set up your tools and your wheel for wheel throwing. Now we're going to visit my studio and see how I set up for wheel throwing. I have a variety of different tools that are set out for me to wheel throw. The very basics, I have my wheel. This is a bat that I throw on. It's not attached to the wheel yet. I will show you how to attach that later. I have a paddle. This is for preparing my clay. I have two wooden modeling tools, a needle tool. I have my bucket with water, warm water, and I have a chamois, and I have a sponge. But these are the tools I'm going to use to form my bowl later on. I have a wire cutter. That's really important for throughout the entire process. I have two wooden ribs here that I use a lot. I have two metal ones that I use, and then I have a rim tool. These are two rib tools. Those are made out of bamboo, and they're really nice shapes that I like to use. I have a very large plastic rib for getting the perfect edge. Uh, some other wood modeling tools. This is a large uh, tool for opening deep down in tall pots. I have an extra sponge because sometimes my sponge gets yucky and I need a new one. Then I have these tools for decorating. Don't forget you're going to need fresh clay and an apron. Thinking about how much clay you need, you need to think about what you're making. So today I'm going to be making some tumblers and I have one right here. And for this one I would need a small ball of clay, maybe about this big around. And the same for this one. This is a container with a cork. It would be a little bit more clay, but not too much. So we're going to start with those today. Okay, remember we're making a tumbler. We're making a small cup. And so first we need to measure out our clay. So I'm going to undo this bag and bring the plastic all the way down. I'm going to get my wire tool. I'm going to clean it off first. And I'm going to wrap it around the clay and pull it through. And now it's time to paddle up your clay so you can prepare it for throwing on the wheel. You're compressing it and getting the air bubbles out. Okay, here we have a poster of profiles of pots. I look at these before I throw every single time so I have a good idea of what I'm going to make and what the inside is going to look like. So you've prepared your clay, you've set out your tools, you have an apron on, you're ready to go. So the next thing you're going to do is watch the next video on attaching your bat to the wheel and centering your clay and get going on making your first piece. Thank you for watching and please send me an email if you have any questions. Thank you very much.